Heavy metal toxicity can happen when our body piles up too much of one or more toxic metals that are harmful to our health. These metals include lead, mercury, cadmium, arsenic, and others. They can find their way into our bodies through contaminated food, air, water, and even many things present in our homes, including paints, dyes, cookware, and even certain beauty products. When these metals build up in our bodies over time, they can cause many health problems. For example, lead toxicity can lead to developmental issues in children and neurological problems in adults. Mercury exposure can affect our nervous system, causing tremors and even memory loss. Cadmium can harm our kidneys, and arsenic can lead to skin issues and even cancer. Heavy metal toxicity can also happen when our bodies can't quickly get rid of these metals, so they pile up over time. But you can identify them by taking a closer look at your skin too. So let's learn about some of the most alarming skin signs of heavy metal toxicity you shouldn't ignore. Number 1. Mercury Toxicity Mercury is usually found in mercury thermometers, and certain types of fish, especially the bigger ones, who have lived most of their lives in polluted waters or have been feeding on small, toxic fish. Some examples are shark, swordfish, king mackerel, tilefish, and big-eye tuna. The kind of mercury present in them is called methylmercury. There's even a form of it in some skin products. Anyhow, when our bodies get overloaded with mercury, it can noticeably appear on our skin too. Pay close attention if your skin color changes to grayish or bluish. This is a sign of mercury toxicity. In addition, you might also experience itching, redness, or even blisters. Mercury toxicity can also cause hyperpigmentation, in which dark spots or patches may show up, and your skin may start flaking or peeling. And lastly, mercury toxicity can also cause abnormal changes in your nails, like yellowing, pitting, or thickening. To avoid mercury toxicity, you can go for small freshwater fish, like salmon, and other seafood like crab or shrimp. They usually have lower mercury levels. Also, if you see any of these skin signs of mercury toxicity, get immediate medical attention to avoid complications. Before we move on, please take a moment to subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon. If you find our videos helpful, please support us by becoming a patron. Number 2. Arsenic Toxicity Arsenic is a natural element present in the Earth's crust. It can be present in both organic and inorganic forms, but the inorganic form is the one that poses a higher risk to our health. Arsenic can make its way into your body through contaminated water or food, cigarette smoke, foods or vegetables that contain traces of pesticides, and even certain cosmetic products like eyeshadows and skin foundations. Also be cautious about consuming foods like rice and certain seafood as they can sometimes contain higher levels of arsenic. One notable skin sign of arsenic toxicity is skin discoloration, in which you may notice dark patches on the neck and chest areas. Additionally, hyperkeratosis, which is characterized by thickened and roughened skin, tends to occur on the palms and soles and indicates chronic arsenic toxicity. Another concerning sign is the development of small raised bumps on the skin, which can sometimes lead to skin ulcers or blisters. You may also notice those white lines, also known as maize lines, on your nails. In the long term, higher levels of arsenic in the body can also increase your risk of developing skin cancers. Number 3. Cadmium Toxicity Cadmium is often found in things like cigarette smoke, spray paint, inexpensive costume jewelry, plastic items like PVC pipes and especially toys, and shellfish. Now let's get into the skin signs you should pay attention to if you're concerned about cadmium toxicity. It may be hard for cadmium toxicity to show up as a skin sign, but it can indirectly affect your skin health by causing damage to your kidneys, liver, bones, gut, and even your reproductive organs. Anyhow, the skin signs of cadmium toxicity include rashes and dry and flaky skin. It can even cause skin ulcers or blisters. Cadmium toxicity can reduce your body's ability to produce red blood cells, leading to symptoms of anemia. So you may also notice changes in the color of your skin like it becoming yellow. Your nails can be affected too, with yellow discoloration. Your hair might become brittle and break easily. Remember, if you suspect you might have cadmium toxicity, don't try to handle it alone. Reach out to a healthcare professional. They'll be able to run a few tests for metal toxicity and guide you on the best steps to avoid complications. Number 4. 
Lead Toxicity Lead toxicity is a serious health concern and can be harmful even in small amounts, especially for children and pregnant women. Lead-based paint is a common source, used in many older homes, particularly the ones built till the late 1970s. When this paint peels or chips, it releases lead dust into the air which you may breathe in. Lead is also found in industrial smoke and in soil around areas with old industrial sites or heavy traffic. Anyhow, when it comes to the skin, there are several signs of lead toxicity that you shouldn't ignore. One of the most noticeable signs is a condition called lead line. It appears as a dark bluish line along the gums and often indicates high severe lead toxicity. Some people with lead toxicity may also develop a skin rash, which may resemble eczema or other dermatological conditions. Additionally, lead toxicity can also cause hyperpigmentation, resulting in darkening or discoloration of affected areas. And lastly, it can also cause symptoms of anemia, which can lead to pale skin. If you are living in an older home, get it checked for lead-based paint. Use cold filtered water for drinking and cooking to reduce the risk of having lead in tap water. Be cautious when purchasing imported products, especially those intended for children. And when you do notice these skin signs of lead toxicity, get yourself checked as soon as possible. Number 5. Chromium Toxicity there are basically two forms of chromium. One of them is trivalent chromium, which is found in many foods like nuts, whole grains, broccoli, green beans, and eggs, and is actually an essential nutrient for our bodies. The other one is hexavalent chromium, which is the toxic form you should be concerned about. Hexavalent chromium, or chromium-6, is commonly present in tobacco smoke, paints, cement, and electronic wastes. You should also pay attention if you are living in an industrial area, especially if welding or cutting of steel happens there. Chromium toxicity can show up in many skin issues like redness, itching, rashes, and even ulcers or blisters on the skin. Inhalation of chromium-6 compounds can result in respiratory symptoms, including coughing, wheezing, shortness of breath, and irritation of the nose and throat. It can also cause lung cancer in the long term. The best way to avoid chromium toxicity is to avoid the sources of chromium-6. And do remember to get yourself tested for chromium-6 toxicity if you notice its signs. Number 6. Aluminum Toxicity Aluminum is naturally present in many foods, water sources and consumer products, including aluminum cookware, certain antacids that contain aluminum compounds, some baking powders, and certain processed foods that may contain aluminum additives, such as processed cheese cake mix frostings, pancake syrups, etc. While aluminum is generally considered safe in small amounts, aluminum toxicity is closely related to neurological and bone-related issues. In fact, aluminum toxicity has also been studied for its potential to cause Alzheimer's disease. As for skin signs of aluminum toxicity, it can cause symptoms of pruritus or itching, eczema-like rashes that may look red, itchy, and scaly in addition to contact dermatitis that may lead to inflammation and itching on the skin. So if you notice these skin signs of heavy metal toxicity that I've shown you in this video, don't ignore them and get yourself checked as soon as possible. Thank you for watching and subscribing to the channel. See you in the next video.